I-37M got a paternity test done and now my wife might divorce me over it, help newest update. Day. My wife 35F and I-37M have been married for 12 years. We have three kids and I always had this nagging feeling that our middle child wasn't mine. Our oldest and youngest look just like me, but my middle child doesn't. My wife has shown me a picture of her grandfather and he does look a lot like him, but he just doesn't have any of my family features, he looks so different than anyone else in the family. I decided I wanted a paternity test to put my mind at ease. My wife got pretty upset when I brought it up because cheating has always been a deal breaker for her, but I just saw that as all the more reason to get one done. I told her that if she had nothing to hide she should have no problem with getting one done. I tested my son and it turns out he's mine. I thought everything was fine, and I had my peace of mind. Except she told me she was going to take the kids and go to her parents for a while. When I asked why she exploded and told me that she was seriously considering divorcing me over the stunt, that she was furious with me for doubting her loyalty to me knowing how she felt about cheating and that she would never forgive me for what I put our son through, making him question his place in the family. I tried to get her to see my side, but I just wanted to be sure, and that surely she could see why I'd question it when he looks nothing like me. She told me she would never forgive me for this, and that I hoped my foolish pride was worth the cost of my family. She hasn't spoken to me since. I need advice on how to get her to talk to me and get her to see my side of the story and that it wasn't some attack on her character like she seems to think it was. I don't want a divorce. TLDR. I got a paternity test on my middle child because he doesn't look like me, and my wife wants to divorce me over it update got a paternity test and now my wife might divorce me over it. So, it's been a couple months now, and I thought I'd update. My wife finally agreed to a sit down with me a couple weeks after I posted, and as some of you said, she doesn't t want to stay with me. We talked and basically it boiled down to she wants a divorce because I don't trust her and think so poorly of her character that I thought she'd pass another man's child off as mine. She then said she'll never forgive me for treating my son so abhorrently he asked why I hated him. I didn't realize I treated him so differently, but apparently it was obvious. I tried to defend myself, but she asked what I meant then, because no matter how I tried to dress it up, I accused her of cheating and treated our son like trash because he wasn't my spitting image. She then brought up she wondered if I was projecting because only one of us ever had infidelity in their background and it wasn't her. That's done, because while yes, I had cheated in two past relationships, I've never cheated on her. I said that. But she said she'd never cheated at all, but that didn't stop me from accusing her of it did it? So now my kids won't talk to me and my wife wants to divorce me. All over a paternity test. Update 2 I need advice on how to get my wife to talk to me, help please. My wife and I are divorcing against my will over me getting a paternity test. She wouldn't spend Christmas with me, or make our middle child see me, though she did offer to send our other two, and she refused to have dinner with me on my birthday, despite me asking her several times to do so. I finally got frustrated when she refused to see me this weekend and told her she needed to start working with me so we can work this out and she needs to stop coddling our child and make him see me too. My wife refuses to work with me at all, and refuses to send my son who I, in her words, treated like shit to see me against his will. I really think if I could just get her to see me, I could convince her to talk this out with me. I don't want to be the first person in my family to end up divorced. My mom says to give her space because she thinks I messed up by doing what I did, and any chance of reconciliation needs to be on her terms not mine, but my dad is actually mad at me because he thinks I acted like a piece of crap and less polite words and ruined my relationship and he has taken my wife and child's side completely. I don't want to let this keep festering, so I actually need good advice to get her to agree to talk things out with me.